Hello guys, in today's video, we're gonna check out the best coffee machine in this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I've tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability, and many more. To find out more information about these coffee machine, you can check out the description below. If you wanna get a best quality coffee machine according to your needs, then watch the video till the end, and then decide to buy. At the first position of our list, we have Delong He All in One Coffee and Espresso Maker. Several aspects of the Delong He All in One Coffee and Espresso Maker are designed to simplify things, making it an excellent option for anyone looking to try the barista experience. This is immediately evident from the machine's split design. On one side, there's a cafe style porta filter for espresso and an adjustable milk frother. On the other, there's a 10 cup glass carafe for drip coffee. It's an intuitive setup that visually guides new users to their preferred coffee beverage. Plus, espresso and drip coffee can even be brewed simultaneously. So nothing will slow down your morning routine. During our lab testing, the Dalong Hue was quickest to steam, produced the best milk, and had the fastest recovery time between drinks. The milk frother is also clearly labeled to alternate between denser, finer foam for lattes and lighter, more voluminous foam for cappuccinos. While the Espression model produced a superior espresso shot on its own, if you are a cappuccino drinker, this is a clear choice among the group. Our taste testers also gave the Delonghi top ratings in its coffee's taste. Three different testers dubbed it coffee that they would always look forward to waking up to. We found this device relatively easy to clean, with minimal coffee grinds trapped in the crevices of the machine. However, while using the machine, water overflow began leaking out the back without warning as soon as drip tray was full, so we had to be mindful to clean it out often. It has a removable water reservoir on the espresso side for easier filling and cleaning, plus a front-loading reservoir on the coffee side. The Comfiv 132 model is a newer version of a previous Delonghi coffee and espresso maker. The two are very similar in price and design, but this updated Comfiv 132 model has a digital touchscreen display, which provides a sleeker aesthetic and further enhances convenience. In all, this model was one of the best machines overall for its versatility, superiority on the drip coffee side, and ability to produce a cappuccino and latte with that sought after milk texture. Moving on to the next and number two with Meal CM5300 countertop coffee system. With intuitive touch controls, a sleek design, and rich, barista-worthy coffee, the Meal CM5300 countertop coffee machine packs luxury into every sip. While customers should expect to pay a hefty price, we found that this product offers something unparalleled, a high-quality cup in about 45 seconds with minimal effort. The Meal CM5300 has nine preset drink options, ranging from must-haves, like lattes and cappuccinos, and more creative drinks, like ristrettos and macchiatos. While working with it at our lab, we found users can adjust drink size and coffee temperature. Further separating it from most coffee and espresso machines, the Meal CM5300 automatically frosts and pours the milk for your drinks, too. Our at-home tester said that this was one of her favorite aspects of the machine, especially if you don't want to fuss with your coffee to froth milk ratios. While we enjoyed the automatic cleaning system while pulling back-to-back -back shots during testing, other regular cleaning is still required and can be a bit time-consuming. This model ranks slightly lower in our ease of cleaning category because the drip tray. Drip tray cover, coffee grounds container, and water container all have to be washed regularly and the manual suggests cleaning out the brew unit and main dispenser about once a week. On the flip side, our coffee expert pointed out that while the maintenance prompts might be slightly annoying, this will also allow users to not neglect their super automatic machines and keep their investment humming along for a long time. The number three position is held by Ninja Specialty Coffee Maker. French press drinkers rejoice. The Ninja Specialty Coffee Maker has the characteristics of a French press without the cleanup. While putting it through its paces in our lab, we found that the Ninja equipped with a mesh filter produces a full-bodied cup of coffee. While there were some grounds in the bottom of its pores, fans of French presses and the oils that extract from coffee beans will love this machine. Users can make drinks ranging from a frothy latte to a standard cup of coffee and choose between six different brew sizes, a single cup to a full carafe. There's even an option for iced coffee drinks, a feature that further sets the Ninja Specialty Coffee Maker apart from other machines we tested. During our blind taste test, we noticed that the Ninja's intense, 
Full-bodied coffee taste was one of the only machines that truly had split results, and came down to personal preference. Some gave glowing reviews about the coffee's richness, while others found it a bit too muddy for their liking. One other thing our testers noted is that it does not produce a true espresso, though the device does make a thick coffee that can make specialty drinks, such as lattes, cappuccinos, and macchiatos. While testing it out with milk-based drinks, the Ninja's fold-away compact frother successfully turned milk into a silky smooth froth. The Ninja was efficient throughout its testing from beginning to cleanup. While brewing a carafe of coffee, it had a faster heat-up time by one full minute to the Delonghi. Considering the number of features this machine offers, with the right audience of coffee drinkers, this maker definitely ranks in at a fair price to its competitors and is worth the purchase. Next at number 4, we have Espression Stainless Steel Machine Espresso and Coffee Maker. This stainless steel combination maker was one of the top performers across the board in our testing, especially if you start your day with drip coffee or espresso. Our coffee expert weighed in that this machine is equipped with a paper filter for drip, so it wasn't surprising that this made it the cleanest cup of coffee that we tried throughout testing. For that reason, if you like light roast, this is the machine for you. The coffee side of this unit can make up to 10 cups of coffee at a time and stays warm for hours thanks to its warming plate. If it's your goal to be sipping on espressos at home without ducking out to a cafe, the Espression could also be your top pick for that reason, too. With a fast heat-up time and memorable taste, the aptly named Espression overperformed during our lab test while we pulled countless espresso shots. Its espresso shots were consistently longer than its competitors, such as the Delonghi, and with gentler extractions, espresso without sour and bitter notes. That said, we noticed the Delonghi had a nicer foam quality than the Espresso did while we compared drinks side by side. If you like to be more involved in your daily espresso ritual, the Espresso could be a better fit than automatic machines like the Meal or Jura, which didn't make our list, texturally and flavor-wise. During our taste testing, the Espresso earned a clear 5 rating and proved that its shots were closer to the full flavor and body of real espresso that you'd find from a professional machine at your local coffee shop. But of course, this espresso doesn't come at the touch of a button. Users need to manually add their coffee to the portafilter and tamp the grounds properly. When it came time for cleanup, the Espresso's removable frontal water tank and drip tray were both effortless to clean by hand. Overall, the Espresso feels and looks the closest to a professional machine you can show off on your kitchen counter. The number 5 position is held by Bioletti Mocha Express. The Bioletti Mocha Express was invented in 1933 and has been a beloved source of espresso-like coffee for the near century since. It does not technically produce real espresso because it brews with less pressure than commercial espresso makers, but the final product is still close to espresso in taste and consistency. In fact, mocha pots are alternatively referred to as stovetop espresso makers. A major appeal of this device is that you can make a richer espresso-like cup or one that's lighter and closer to drip coffee by adjusting the grind size. Ali Karen, the product manager at Barstavellet, recommends using a fine to medium grind for a heavier body and stronger flavor. After testing it ourselves, we found that when using high heat on a coil burner with medium ground coffee, it only took three minutes to brew. On a standard medium heat with a fine grind, it took just over 10 minutes, but this produced a very strong brew. Keep in mind that this model's handle gets very hot, so be sure to grab it with a towel or oven mitt when removing it from the stovetop. The Moco Express is sturdy, hard to break, and exceptionally uncomplicated to use, earning a 5 in our ease of use category. Second to the automatic meal, unlike other espresso machines on this list, you can easily take the Moco Express on the go from your stovetop to a campsite and beyond. This model is available in an array of sizes, ranging from 1 to 12 cups. Be aware that this figure can be a bit misleading, as each cup represents one serving of espresso. For example, a 3-cup pot produces just 4.3 ounces of coffee. Nonetheless, the item is cheaper than standard combination coffee and espresso machines, even at its largest size, making it a great value for money option. Machine. It makes tasty beverages at rapid speed. We timed this Nespresso model's heat-up speed during our lab testing, and it clocked in at 3 seconds, which is the fastest out of all the machines on our list. Once it heated up, it also had an extremely fast brew time, too, taking roughly 15 seconds. When it came time to taste, we tested the model's various brew size options, including the travel size mug, which produced a lungo with an impressive line of velvety crema. 
While the Nespresso's can produce coffee, it really is just an Americano, so coffee drinkers be warned. Though its Espresso's bold taste was great and without any acidity, while the Virtuos convenience is a huge selling point, simply pop in an espresso capsule and press brew. We also found it shockingly quiet, durable, and easy to clean. Our editors noted the machine itself is very slim and can be swiftly stowed away in most cabinets. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Braun Brew Sense Drip Coffee Maker KF6050. Whether you're looking for a budget-oriented machine to fill a gap in your kitchen or you're after a compact machine for a college dorm, the Braun Brew Sense manages to hit a sweet spot between price and quality that secures a top position here. The Brew Sense KF6050 comes in just under $100 but still manages to brew great tasting coffee with some excellent quality of life features as well. You won't be fiddling around with too many complicated settings here, which may be a blessing if you simply want to make a cup of coffee in the morning. However, you'll still have access to a programmable timer, brew pause settings, and a 1-4 cup setting for smaller brews. While that compact design certainly looks great, we did find it difficult to access the water and coffee reservoirs. However, at this price point a little frustration in refilling your machine is an excellent trade-off for performance that beats out the competition. There are certainly plenty of additional extra features that we don't usually see in this price bracket, like the charcoal water filter and permanent gold tone filter. However, it's worth remembering that you won't have access to any strength settings as per that basic but affordable design ethos. The Bruce Sense KF6050 is one of the cheaper models in the range and can regularly be found for between $80 and $100. The number 8 position is held by Technivore Makamaster KBGV Select. The Technivore Makamaster KBGV Select is the company's latest model, first released in late 2019 as the Makamaster KBG Select in Europe. The new release continues the Makamaster's highly respected name as the highest quality and most widely praised coffee maker on our list. It's been engineered for optimal brew temperatures and water dispersal, with innovative features that have earned it recognition from the Specialty Coffee Association. What's more, it does all of this while operating exceedingly quickly. Handmade in the Netherlands, this pricey coffee maker has a unique industrial aesthetic that some people love and others hate. This, however, is one for the enthusiasts and lacks a few of the convenience features you might find in cheaper models. The water tank is fixed onto the system, and you won't find any auto-brew features baked in here. However, what it lacks in the amenities that are typical of today at home brewers, it makes up for in producing smooth, balanced coffee. There's technical brilliance under the hood, however. This machine can reach industry standard temperatures, 196 decks, 205 decks in under a minute, and stay there. The water then moves up a glass tube and into a nine-hole spray arm where it's evenly dispersed over ground coffee in a cone-shaped basket. Not only that, but the KBGV Select can do all of this in four to six minutes, depending on brew size. It comes at a steep cost, but the superior performance and build quality make it worth it for coffee enthusiasts. Next at number nine, we have Ninja Hot and Cold Brewed System with Thermal Carafe. The Ninja Hot and Cold Brewed System turns your kitchen into a full-on cafe. Casual drinkers may find it too overwhelming, but coffee and tea lovers will appreciate the flexibility of being able to make their beverages as simple or fancy as they want right from home. Capable of brewing a wide range of coffees, teas and cold brews, temperature and brew times are all automatically adjusted based on your choice of drink, selected from the display panel. Ninja claims that, using the specialty coffee setting and the included milk frother on the side of the machine, you can make coffee bar drinks at home. That's true if you're not super fussy about the quality of the coffee in your CC nose, as the machine brews strong coffee but not espresso like the coffee shops. We were particularly happy with the medium roast coffee brewed on the classic setting, yielding a smooth and well-balanced cup though the rich preset also served our dark roast particularly well. In our testing we found that, while impressively quick, the cold brew setting didn't offer a particularly smooth taste. However, an XL cup of perfectly fine cold brew was whipped up in just 10 minutes, which is a real benefit for anyone seeking extra convenience. Being able to produce more complex coffee brews at home makes for an incredibly versatile machine, especially considering tea drinkers are also accounted for here as well. The smart basket system will automatically register the brew basket you are using and recommend drink types as well. Not only was the delay brew programming feature a godsend, 
But we also appreciated how quiet the Ninja Hawk and cold brewed system was, only whirring slightly while kicking off the brewing process. If you're one of those households with single serve and multi cup brewers, this appliance can replace both and make a single cup without using coffee pots. However, if you don't foresee a need for cold brew or tea functionality, you can save money with the cheaper Ninja specialty further down the page. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Breville Bambino Plus. The Breville Bambino Plus, known as the Sage Bambino Plus in the UK, is an excellent espresso machine for anyone who wants both the convenience of an easy-to-use system and the space to experiment and explore on a more sophisticated level. We found excellent consistency between brews here and a well-balanced shot thanks to the customizable pre-infusion techniques. We were also really able to make the most of some premium beans as the Bambino Plus also offers standard professional grade filter baskets alongside easier to use double walled filters as well. While that will only be a draw for those with a precise grinder and some tamping practice, it's worth noting that all skill levels are catered for here. It only takes three seconds to warm this machine up, an impressive feat considering it can be minutes before a cheaper device is ready to start brewing. While you're certainly paying a little extra for this model than you would an entry-level device, aforementioned features like customizable pre-infusion times and the array of baskets included with the machine mean you're actually getting some top-tier specs at a great price here. That's all for today. We upload all types of coffee products and coffee accessories review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.